Just 20 minutes outside of Waco is the quiet town of McGregor. It's the type of place where your kids can still ride their bikes down the middle of the street. Nearby, tucked within the trees, is a Magnolia Haven. Two neighboring vacation rentals open to anyone who would like to live here for a few days. To learn more about these properties, let's head to Magnolia Market at the Silos in Waco. If you love the Magnolia brand and all things Chip and Joe as much as I do, amazing news is that you can actually kind of live in Magnolia, in a way. Jordy Barksdale, it's so good to chat with you. Thank you so much, I appreciate it. Okay, talk me through the vacation rentals where people can come and stay in the Waco area. Yeah, absolutely. So uh, we're part of our vacation rentals. We've got options for guests of all different party sizes. So you have a big group or a small group. And the cool thing about our vacation rentals is that it creates this really unique experience when you come to Waco. That's more than just staying in a hotel or whatever it may be. These homes were bought by Chip and Joanna, um, redone and repurposed for the sake of creating a really fun place for guests to just get away in their journey to Waco. So um, we see lots of groups of friends, lots of families, um, whatever people are celebrating, our homes, our vacation rentals here in Waco have been a great, a great stop for those guests. Our first stop for us was the Magnolia House. Yes. It was fantastic. Will you tell me a bit about this property? Yeah, so some folks have seen Magnolia House because it was featured on Fixer Upper. Um, it's one of the first homes and it's right outside of Waco. And the cool thing is you walk in and you can really see a lot of what was uh, made Joanna's design style famous with some of the shiplap walls. just live in the upstairs and be totally fine my whole life. And in that main room upstairs, there's these little side rooms that are that are called soldier rooms. And there are these little nooks. And then downstairs, there's a there's additional rooms and, and, and two baths downstairs. And so one of my favorite parts of the Magnolia House is all the patio seating on the sides. And so the Magnolia House is, is one of the original OG experiences for our for as a getaway for our guests. We get to stay in the carriage house. And as soon as we walked in, I started feeling like I could I could live here. Like yeah. I could just not ever leave. Oh goodness gracious. Look how pretty this is. Peter, is it just me or does it seem like we just walked into Chip and Joe's house? <laughs> Amazing. Everything's bright and fresh, but also there's hints of character and distressed wood and You think we can just stay here? because I could definitely live in this kitchen. We're gonna have to eat in this dining room just to eat in the dining room. It's so nice. With the shiplap and the big uh, rolling barn doors. That lead to entertainment the whole family can enjoy together. It's so inviting and warm. It's good to hear. And that's the goal. And the goal is for sure to um, give people a chance to connect as a family. And the unique thing about the, the carriage house is um, that used to be originally located in the DFW area. And we actually brought it down. Um, and if you've seen that on the show, the, the innkeepers, if you will, used to live right there for the Magnolia House. We might have freaked out a little bit when we realized that we came from Grapevine yeah. and that house came from Grapevine, which still kind of blows my mind exactly, a little bit. Exactly, exactly, which is also where Chip is from. This is what happens when you travel with Jessica. You step away for two minutes and think she's working on her computer and you come back and there's a feast of charcuterie bliss. Right here, just for us to eat. To optimize your stay, we suggest stocking your fridge with some of our favorite Magnolia edibles, like their delicious crust-free sandwiches, pimento cheese, chicken salad, and egg salad, whipped butter in seasonal flavors, including lemon and mixed berry citrus. And don't forget to stop at their bakery to pick up some of their precisely iced cupcakes. And isn't it true though that there's no better way to connect than over a meal? Yeah. 
So much of what Magnolia believes in is that everyone deserves a seat at the table and that everyone's opinions, their perspectives and their stories matter. And so we love the ability to say, come stay at this house, find your friends and family enjoying meals together. And we just hope that in our vacation rentals, um, our guests, wherever they're traveling from, find a bit of rest, that it truly feels like an exhale. Now you cannot make plans for the weekend and just sit on the couch, make dinner in our beautiful kitchens. We're thankful for the whole overall experience that those provide. So if you're coming, you're like, I want the Magnolia experience in Waco. The vacation rentals are truly a cherry on top of that. Jordy, thank you so much for hosting us. And it has been an absolute pleasure getting to stay with you all. Yeah, we're so glad you guys came down. Thanks so much for being here. To plan your trip, book early and go online to magnolia.com backslash visit.